Well, hey there, my name's Roscoe. I'm a test dummy, but I'm not just any regular test dummy. I am the most fearless test dummy that you have ever encountered in your entire life. That's right, I'm not afraid of anything. You could throw crossbows at me, you could give me miniguns, you could even give me giant swinging axes, and I will not be afraid of any of them. That's right, I don't fear anything. Anything apart- Oh my goodness, what in the hell is that? Don't do it, friends. No, 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 you don't want to. Oh my goodness, oh my goodness. Well, that sucked. What is going on, everybody? My name is Hypercore Ripper, and today we are back playing Happy Room. That is right, guys. This right here, this game right here has returned to the channel. This is Happy Room, the happiest game in the whole wide world. A game where you take this poor, unsuspecting man down into a dungeon, because the dungeon, that's like the new update, okay? That's part of it. And we're gonna do all kinds of horrible, depraved, evil things to this poor man right here, and uh, that's about the most of it. Did I also mention that we have not played this game in two years? But welcome back to Happy Room, guys. As I just said, it has been a very long time since we have last played this game, around about the two-year mark. This game just received a dungeon update, so we've got, like, a new area. We have got lots of lovely new weapons to, uh, hopefully inflict some pain on this poor, unsuspecting man right here. And that's about the most of it. And you guys seem to really enjoy this series when we originally did it on the channel, so if you enjoy this video, I know that this gentleman right here would love Drop it if that, like boy. Thing. That, that thing, you know, the thing that we all ask you to do, and maybe I will do some more for you. And I don't really know how many edits I'm going to be able to squeeze into this video as well. Like, there are only so many times that, you know, I can uh, get one of, like, let's say, I can get a spider, I can put it below him, I can hit the play button, I, I can- Oh my- Oh! 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 You, uh, hopefully understand what I'm saying. But anyway, as you can see here at the top, I've already completed some of the missions and some of the tasks that we have been assigned in this brand new update. I've also unlocked a bunch of the new weaponry, just to get us a little bit ahead of time. I don't really want to bore you guys with the beginning things, like unlocking sort of the basic weapons and whatnot, but I've got some tasks up here that are going to be pretty fun for us to beat. And I need to give this crossbow one a go first. So we need to get 12 crossbow hits while our dummy is on the pitchfork. So if I were to place a pitchfork right above your head buddy and actually maybe even if we were to just get like maximum crossbows the most amount of crossbows we can get we should be able to beat this nice and quick down you go my friend back up you go then they fire at you then you go back down then you get uh, then, then you go then you go onto that thank you there we go we did it Alrighty, that was a good one. That was really easy. I'm surprised I hadn't done that already. So the next one we need to do is hold a dummy on a mace for 15 seconds. So if we can get you to hold on for 15 seconds, there we go. That's working. That's very nicely, very nicely working here. Just you maces, you keep him held up and it'll be all good. This is good, guys. It's as good as done right now. I think I can set it. So there we go. We did it. And a little strategy that I've been doing so far to sort of get my levels up a little bit faster is sort of spamming him with mines like all. All of these mines right underneath him, which are going to stick to him and, you know, ultimately really freaking hurt him. They're pretty good at leveling up, so I'm just going to put down as many as I possibly can. Then he's going to come cascading down, and yeah, then he's going to explode. Alrighty, that's looking pretty good. Are you going to- I nearly- <laughs> Oh! 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 He's alive. He's fine. Would you look at him? He's, he's dead. And he's trying to get these a little bit more lined up with him, though. There's like a couple here on the outside that he like missed touching there. All right, down you go, my friend. Just touch all of the mines. <laughs> oh. Oh, this is madness. This is ridiculous. I am so sorry to do this to you, my friend. I'm going to put an extra one there. Hopefully, he'll touch it. Hopefully, that might... Oh, my goodness. I think that right there is a guillotine. We are so close. We did get a new record, which has got us a little bit more money. It's $1 under... Are you kidding me? $1 underneath a new bomb. Oh, fine then. I guess we're going to have to try and do something else. What is this one right here? Place a weapon on a block. That sounds really, really easy, but... I. What? I seriously just have to place a weapon on a block? Does that even mean like a spider? I'm assuming a spider counts as well. Oh, look at the spider. <laughs> Ew. Yeah, that, that's disgusting. Wow, where, 
Where did it go? Stick a dummy to a block with cobwebs? Okay, I can do that as well. That is worth one upgrade point. So if I put the spider right there, we hit play. The spider goes down. What the heck? This is too easy right now. Why game are you making this so easy for me right now? I mean, I'm not complaining. That is not a complaint whatsoever. Okay, I'm fine with making it as easy for me as I possibly can. So right now I've got the tier one upgrade for the bomb. I've also got the minigun one. I've also got the saw. And I think I'm going to go for miscellaneous with the block. And what that allows us to do is simply place a weapon of our choice or a weapon that'll attach literally anywhere around this block. Next challenge is cover a dummy in cobwebs. Really? These, they feel really easy right now. Like all I need to do is just spam a load of spiders. He's going to fall through them and they're going to cover him in cobwebs. Hey, look at this poor guy. They're munching him. They're numbing him. They're going to completely coat him. They're coating his face. Oh, but they... Oh. Oh, does that mean we need more spiders underneath him? Okay, I mean, I will happily give him more spiders. I don't know, though, if he really wants a spider. He looks a little bit terrified. Is this enough? Six spiders. Surely this has got to be enough. If we speed that up right there, then hopefully that's going to go all the way to the top and down. What the heck? What we need to do is just get more spiders to touch him. So I'm just going to put them all around him. And I've also put a jump pad here. So hopefully when we do this, he's going to go up and down. All the spiders going to crawl. Oh, even. Oh, this is good. Good as done. Good as done. Maybe it's good as done. Maybe, maybe maybe we failed again. Maybe a voodoo doll. That's one of the other items that I unlocked. Maybe if he can then touch all of them, then that will... Oh my goodness. Okay, so the voodoo doll, that's what we need to use from now on. All right, that's good. So now let's delete everything. We have now got 4,354. I really want to get to this next weapon. So what I'm going to do is spam down a load more bombs just underneath him and see if we can get that pain rating up. All right, buddy, down you go. There you go. Grab the bombs. Grab the bombs and get only a little... Oh my god, we did it. We got the guillotine. Alright, let's see what this thing is like then. If we put this right down there below, you have you just fall down into... Oh my god, what is that that just got chopped off? I don't know. I'm quite liking that guillotine, and I'm quite liking what I'm seeing here. I simply want to get five of these things to fire. I don't know if we have to, like, do it at once, or why this isn't really working right now. It kind of is. Like, it's gone up a little bit, but, like, as for the rest of it, I, I don't really know. <laughs> like, does it need to be all at once? I don't really understand understand why this is not doing anything. It says fire five miniguns, so why has it just not done a thing? Firing five miniguns should be easy, so I put these jump pads down here, which are just going to push him back into the middle, like like so, but it's it's still not really doing anything. Why miniguns are you failing me? Oh, wait, 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 it's doing something. It's going up a little bit. It's, uh, it's not doing, um, uh, a bloody thing. Heckin' bloody thing right now. There's still a little bit of space there for one more. If you'd like to... Like to die... Die... De he, he died in the corner. He's de very dead. We got a new record as well, but that's not good enough. I don't want a new record. I want to freaking beat this challenge. I put the five required miniguns on the ceiling here. Like, it says fire five miniguns. Those are five miniguns. Like, as soon as we fire... Like, there, they all fired. Why is that not working? I don't know what I am doing wrong here. Are we meant to, like, burn through all of the miniguns? Like, burn through five miniguns or what? He's still getting bounced around, though. It's still kind of going up. It's, like, halfway at the moment. But why... Why is this not working? Please let this work. For the love of everything, for the love of this poor little man and all of the bullets that he is receiving, all of the pain that he's... Re there we go, it worked. Okay, what we're going to do now is focus on some of these other ones that we haven't beaten. We're kind of getting a little bit ahead of ourselves right now, so we're going to beat some of these older challenges that have been set there. This first one is going to be the axe. So let's say he sort of flies from this one to another one over here, which is then going to maybe push him into another one and maybe even like another one somewhere else. Is that gonna do it for you, my friend? You're receiving some- Oh, he was receiving some lovely little taps there. Now we gotta bounce him back over. Back to where you came. You need to go and hug those lovely little spinning axes over there, okay? They're being very nice to you. You need to not lie on the ground. You just gotta go down into the axes, my friend. They're gonna cause you lots of pain and lots of agony. <laughs> yeah, that, that absolutely did it. $5,000. Okay, so what I'm gonna do once again, we're gonna go back for this bombing test and see how many we can get down. I'm gonna try and be a little bit more organized this time. I feel like the last couple times I've tried this, they've been a little bit askew and all over the place, so I'm going to try and get them perfectly below him. We could try and put some down here on the ground as well. So, my friend, there you go. You go down. Oh, he touched all of them. My goodness, did that work. It didn't get us a new weapon, but it did get us a new record. And what I found that if you sort of do this a few times, like if you re-roll it a like few times here and there, then you usually get a new record every time. Like, even without putting down any new mines, it's still 
sometimes gets you a new record or more money. Give me some more money, please. I want more money to cause more pain. There you go. See, that fucking works. Gravity changer, huh? So if I put that down there, I'm guessing as soon as he... Yeah, as soon as he... Oh. No, don't do it. We can have fun with this. So why don't we put one of these gravity changers down here and then we're gonna spam this area just up here with these lovely little goblin friends. Like he's gonna think he's all safe and he's all happy and la 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 and then he's gonna come back up here and, and die because of these evil disgusting creatures. There you go. Oh, they're, they're very keen. They're really, really keen. <laughs> Oh, the goblins are so great. Oh, they're so good. They're so good. That one's bouncing around. It's stabbing him. He's dead. Uh, you can stop now. He's, he's, uh, look at his face. We got ourselves another upgrade point as well, which I think actually I'm going to give to the jumper. Exploding on impact sounds very, very useful. That's just a little bit more pain that we can add to a run if we decide to use them. Deal 3,999 damage with a guillotine. Okay, well, there's some guillotines down there for you. Oh. Oh, oh no, oh no. <laughs> Is that gonna count? It's on his foot, dude. Chop his foot right now. Come on, guillotines. Just chop him a little bit like his arm is there. That guillotine could easily just cut his fingers there. That would probably get us enough pain. Maybe we could try and space these things out a little bit. I've noticed that he kind of bounces when he touches them or when the guillotine actually comes down. So let's see if uh, the, the leg one, yeah, that's gonna take him up and... What? Maybe we need these jumpers in between, or maybe just in between these two here. I think that's where he's probably gonna get stuck, or maybe it's not. Maybe this guillotine is gonna lift him in the air, and... Oh! 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 Damn it. That was looking so good. Why would that not work? Okay, fine. Well, I'm going to put another jumper then all the way in this corner just to bounce him back over here. Please work this time. I am begging you. I just want to see him get guillotined like quite a lot. I, I want the, the pain. I want to, you know, win and get more money so that I can continue to cause more pain. Uh, uh, you can you can stop now. Please. It's... it's uh, Okay, he's dead. 20 arrows miss a dummy. Okay, I'm pretty sure that I could do 20 arrows miss a dummy. If we just sort of spread these all the way around, then hopefully that's going to be about 20 arrows worth. 20 arrows worth of missed shots. Okay, so hopefully that can be achieved with a bounce pad, or, or maybe it can't really, or maybe, maybe it freaking can. Enlarge six spiders? Wait a second. Whoa, 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 whoa. Are you serious right now? Enlarging six spiders? That should not uh, be allowed, but I think it might even work. Yeah, that's, uh, I'm sorry. I'm very, very sorry, my friend. I'm very, very sorry that I'm actually going to continue to do this to you until I beat this challenge. Can I squeeze these in just here? Yes, I can. Oh my goodness. These are going to be the loveliest, largest spiders that, <laughs> that you have ever seen. I, I enlarged six Spiders can one two three four five six that that six white what why is this not working? Let's see. It's sort of getting there I am enlarging six spiders dude. Come on. Why are you you're only getting I, I don't understand this game at all It's really really confusing me. I've put down two of these. Okay, that kind of works Maybe we need a third is that how these voodoo things work you have to put down multiple ones then for it not to work Maybe we need more spiders down as well. Is that a thing that you really want right now? You really want me to paint the area around you in these killer spiders? I mean, we can do that. We can also add some overkill by putting down some of these jump pads, and maybe even we can put down some more voodoos down here. Like, I really want to ensure that we get this one right now. It doesn't make any sense that we haven't got it. There we go. We did get it. Back to doing these bombs as well, and we, uh, we just unlocked a, a fish. I want to see a fish. Okay, little fishy. I'm going to put down multiple fishies. I don't really know what you... <laughs> Uh, yeah, that's that's silly. I, I like silly. I I like that they explode as well. They're explosive fishies. I greatly like that these are explosive fishies. I love that they cling on, they explode, and then they keep bouncing around until they touch them again. Oh, you poor person. How does it feel to have gotten exploded by fish? How does it feel that that one right there? Yeah, those ones right there. There's one more coming for you. It's it's gonna get you. It it will it, it will. 
I told you. Also wondering how a room full of goblins is going to fare against him with, say, let's see, some jumper pads on the ground just so he doesn't miss the second wave. Definitely want you to get both waves of these lovely, brutal little goblins which are causing you all of the pain right now. Not enough to nearly get us near a new weapon, though. A floor full of miniguns might be a good idea as well. You'd like to think seeing as they spew like thousands of rounds a second and, you know, they kind of juggle him in the air. They kind of, they, they juggle him around a little bit more. They, they're not letting him get over to the other side, though. Like, that would be so good if they would just allow him to visit the other miniguns all the way on the other side of the room. I know you miniguns don't want to allow him to do that, but you have to for the sake of the pain and all the misery that we have to give him all of the, the blood and the limbs that he... No, <laughs> Oh, the limbs that he's missing, my goodness, oh no, that's, that's horrid, that's, it's really mean, you know, you're pushing him against the wall, the poor guy. Oh, this might be a good one, this might be a really good one, actually, okay, so, now he's back in the corner with these, oh, damn, he didn't get enough. There are these three mini guns over here that just couldn't reach him, they just need to be spaced out a little bit more. And now trying a different strategy with these mini guns. I've placed down some bounce pads, which are going to throw him over into this corner here, and hopefully, they're all going to get used up they're all gonna juggle him around and hopefully get used up oh this might be good this might be really good actually there you go guns use your bullets up throw him into the corner just don't throw him back over there into the left side but anyway guys we're gonna clear off the screen and i'm afraid that we are gonna end this video right there so if you've enjoyed it then please drop a like drop a comment uh follow me on all of the stuff down below i'm doing a lot of streams on twitch these days so if you're into that kind of thing then please come and check them out and yeah if you want some more happy room do all the stuff that I just mentioned, and I'll have some Damn, more for son, you, you soon. Uh, Goodbye.